This first component of the exam will be the general inspection of the patient as well as mental status evaluation. So when you're doing a general inspection for the neurologic exam, you're trying to evaluate the patient's general demeanor and their appearance and the clothing that they're wearing. This particular patient has already changed into a gown, but if they were in the clothing that they came in, is it appropriate for the weather and for the situation? Does the patient appear um, to be comfortable with the situation or do they appear to be anxious or nervous in any way? Their general affect. Next will be other orientation. Part of orientation will be assessed um, when you verify the person's identity by verifying their name and date of birth. That's assessing that they're oriented to person. But in addition, you'll need to orient to whether they're oriented to place and time. So, uh, could you verify for me your name and date of birth? John Smith, April 1st, 1992. Okay. So these other questions are ones that I ask routinely to all of my patients. Can you tell me where you are right now? Lake Nona. Lake Nona. And this building? Uh, UCF College of Medicine. All right. Um, and do you know the today's date? December 19th. Close enough. <laughs> <laughs> How about the year? Uh, 2016. 2016. And do you know the day of the week? Tuesday. Tuesday. All right. Thank you. That's a basic um, orientation part of the mental status exam. A complete mental status exam has many more components to it.